contrary to the Fuhrer, was dug up near a train station in West Berlin. DNA testing in 1998 confirmed that the skull was Bormann's. For many, this was proof that Bormann had died in the final days of World War II, and his body was buried at the time at that location. But there are many inconsistencies, and many experts believe that Bormann had fled to South America, along with other Germans, and lived in Paraguay until dying of cancer in 1959. I recently got a copy of Aftermath on eBay, and haven't started reading it yet, but will soon. But certainly there are many people familiar with this case out there, and I would love to hear from you. What do you think was the true fate of Bormann? Death in Berlin in 1945 or in Paraguay in 1959? Please leave your answer in the comments section. If you want to learn more about this case and other unsolved mysteries, such as the D.B. Cooper skyjacking case, be sure to check out my channel. It's called the Anthony R.R. R. Mill Show. Hope to see you there. Thank you and Happy New Year.